Tonight, two officers from the Tampa Police Department have been taken off the streets. Good evening. I'm Jennifer Lee. I'm Keith K. Thank you for joining us. They are under investigation following an incident at Tampa General Hospital. Eight on your side's Melanie Michael is joining us live at TPD headquarters downtown. Keith and Jen, good evening to you both. Those officers remain under investigation tonight as local black elected officials say they want more accountability from the police department and the mayor's office. As the city of Tampa has seen unrest in recent days, the police department is now investigating two of its own. The incident in question took place at Tampa General Hospital. That's according to a statement released by TPD. But right now, that's all the information the department is releasing. A letter drafted by seven black elected officials of Hillsborough County sheds a little more light. They say TPD used force against an unarmed black man back on June 1st at TGH. The elected officials go on to say while the incident was not related to any protest, the alleged actions of those officers was disturbing. In the same letter, elected officials also pointed to other incidents, including the early hours of June 3rd in downtown Tampa. They condemned the use of rubber bullets and tear gas against protesters, calling the actions of TPD aggressive and dehumanizing. Aid on your side reached out for comment from Tampa police. A spokesperson tells us the department cannot release information during an ongoing investigation. Aid on your side also reached out to Tampa General Hospital. The elected officials who drafted that letter and the mayor's office all have declined comment at this time. Keith? Melinda Michael live in Tampa for us tonight. Thank you. Also tonight